And also breaking at this hour, a nearly week long manhunt for an Irvington man is over. Mobile County Sheriff's Office arresting James Caballero this morning at a friend's house on Forest Glen Court. Now Mobile Police charging him with first degree rape, first degree sodomy. This is related to an attack, an alleged attack that happened while he was on the run. Caballero initially wanted for violating the condition of his bond after being arrested for assaulting his estranged wife. Investigators say he contacted the victim even though he was ordered not to. Now he's got several new charges, including rape, sodomy, domestic violence. The DA's office saying that he tricked the victim in this case into meeting him, then raped her at knife point at a hotel room. They say he recorded the sexual assault and then sent it to someone. Deputies tried to arrest Caballero. They say he barricaded himself in an attic, a special ops team, finally able to get him out after 30 minutes. This is now the second standoff with this guy. Very similar to the last time, minus the children. Um, I, I'm sure most people saw that he was, uh, I guess, toying with us on Facebook last week. You know, and, and all along, you know, we just said if, if you want to profess your innocence, turn yourself in. The good thing is, is he's safely back in jail. And prosecutors say they're going to request that Caballero be held.